What it do everyday people man it's your boy PJ today we back with another lit video we back in the confessional and yeah we staying lit big dog man shout out to my everyday people who rock with me every day and uh shout out to my boy lucky was deals man he keeps it late check out his youtube channel make sure y'all hit the hive mind labs link in the description um you can get your super fat burners okay and use the discount code everyday pj at checkout now let's get into it man we got your girl beyonce now this is a fan of beyonce during the mute challenge and she is highly pissed off to the top of pissivity and you can even hear it in the crowd okay uh so if y'all don't know the mute challenge has been trending all year long during beyonce's world tour the renaissance world tour okay and it's i mean i'm talking about people driving for miles i seen my friend she even went to the uh beyonce tour in kansas city and she was holding up like if i could say uh, anything else but she was holding up she went all the way out there and had a good time but they didn't win the mute tour now this was in Houston Texas now imagine y'all trying to win the mute contest or you know the city with the best mute and you got somebody in the crowd like this check it out look around and see my crew <laughs> it was like shut the Okay, who was the butthole who messed up the mute con uh, mute contest or the mute part, whatever you want to call it? I don't know where they mute the song. Okay, like somebody, man, if I was standing next to you or if, or if you were my friend, I probably would have knocked your drink out your hand. Okay, it, we paid all this money for these tickets and we want we've been waiting all night for this mute part, and then you want to yell out and make us mess up? Like, oh my goodness! So, shout out to that butthole. <laughs> They do not play about Beyonce, boy. Now let's take a look at what happened in Kansas City. Kansas City. Kansas City. We're gonna take a look at Kansas City. Shout out to Kansas City, KC Mo. Kansas City Mute Challenge. Yikes. Yeah, man, see, it's always some buttholes in the crowd that want to make stuff make stuff hard for everybody else, man. You know, it's a mute challenge. It means shut up. It just, if you pay $500 or more to get in this uh, concert venue, why you want to be the butthole? Like, I don't see, if I, I, if I was one of the beehive, I would have punched you. Because I, I spent all my money to, uh, no, I wouldn't have punched you. I wouldn't even spend five hundred dollars to get in that concert. I'm gonna be honest. I would have been one of them ones sneaking in. <laughs> it had to be somebody who snuck in or got free tickets who messed that up. Not just a regular Beehive fan would mess that up. It had to be a Jack Rabbit. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying not to curse a lot in these videos. I'm trying to keep it PG, okay? But uh, people in this uh, in Beyonce's videos and uh, concert, they not for it. They'll cuss you out if you didn't messed up. The mute challenge. I'm telling you, they didn't waited all year for this mute challenge. I remember the uh, tickets went on sale, okay, and the mute challenge finally started, and uh, it took a while to catch on because she didn't really let people know. It just started catching on, and then it floated through the Beehive, and now it's going from city to city. So who can have the best mute challenge? But I think the concert is, series is about over with. So. You know, Blue Ivy's, uh, this was Blue Ivy's last concert, I'm assuming, um, from the news articles and what's trending on Beehive. Is, this was uh, Blue Ivy's last concert in Kansas City. So shout out to Blue Ivy. She's having the time of her life. Um, 
I'm sure she's being homeschooled by a traveling teacher or whatever, but you know, I can't wait to see what's new for her in the future. She seems like one of those uh, really good kids. She's been kept off social media and uh, she, you know, her and her sisters, brothers, I don't know, it's like twins or something. They, they having the time of their life and we don't really get to see them much. And so it's good to see Blue Ivy. She doesn't look like she's one of those strange kids, okay? It's one of those strange rich kids. <laughs> Blue seems like she's having a very good time, having the time of her life. So being on stage with her mom. So shout out to her. Shout out to Beyonce. Shout out to all the concert goes, man. Let me know what y'all think in the comment section. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'm going to holler at you later. Peace.